So today again we have some more updates to go on the whole thing surrounding Vibes Cartel retrial. We also have Bunty Killer basically explain why him feel like Vibes Cartel will not walk free and they will order a retrial. So stick around for the details on that. Also we have a video from Dean Jackson Miller basically explaining what went down in court as well. So stick around for the video there. I will have another live from Spice basically exposing more shocking details and that one you kind of more shocking and surprising like me never never expect that one after arm so make sure you know, stick around feel that live the from spices in me but if you're not new just subscribe but more importantly like the video yeah man run up the likes to 100 likes quick and fast you see me but yeah we are kicked off with the whole thing surrounding vibes cartel now as we know d6 ended yesterday and that would have been the final day of vibes cartel trial hearing the the basically the verdict was not handed down yesterday they are saying that they're waiting until the end of the, of the term, which the law term ends in July 31st. They said they will not go beyond that. So Vibe Scotty will be getting a decision in July whether or not he will walk free or um, they will add a retrial basically. Now this is what Bounty Killer um, wrote while sharing the article from the star, basically giving update on the retrial, Vibe Scotty retrial. This is what Bounty Killer posts. So him say, retrial upon speed dial plus BL with no denial, God in the midst. As a Jamaican citizen, I am not afraid to talk, plus I don't owe the taxman or the obvious man. If justice was properly served, then the higher courts would not overturn the conviction. So it only two things can happen now, is to schedule a retrial or grant them bail or let them go point blank. But we all know they are too ashamed and embarrassed to make them walk free so imagine what a regular jamaican would have faced and viewers if you check bunty page now you're not gonna find this because he actually removed the post not sure the reason why but yeah he removed the post but this is what he posted um on the matter after day six yesterday so bunty basically i say oh theme on his opinion that the, the system is too ashamed to let Vibes Cartel walk free even though um, everything would have been um, in Vibes Cartel favor since he went to the Privy Council even this whole retrial hearing you can hear Bishop McDonald, the judge and, and the appeal board um, court of appeal board basically saying that are uh, basically asking some really telling questions to the prosecution why is this case so special um, why should there be a retrial when the men's constitutional rights would have already been breached and even the prosecuting team basically admitting that if the judge should order a retrial there will possibly be other um, constitutional breaches of the men so with all of them things there um, Bunty basically I say even though it looked like it was going a vibe cartel fever I feel like say they might go add a retrial and they might go let him out from bail. But yeah, what do you think? Leave your thoughts on this here in the comment section if you don't agree with Bunty and this. I don't feel like say him just go get um, totally acquitted from these charges by the Court of Appeal. Leave your thoughts on this here in the comment section. Anywho, we have Dean Jackson Miller who was present on court day basically explaining a part where the judge asks why this lizard case this lizard murder thing is so um special or why it's so why the the, uh, the prosecution team appear more attention to this um case than other cases that would have been unpending basically or the judge asked why is this case different what makes this case special and she was asking in the context of the fact that we've heard recommendations and talk about the possibility of this case being set as a priority case to ensure that the men who have already spent all this time in custody wouldn't then be spending another long period in custody if it is that they're not granted bail if a retrial is ordered now the the comparison the judge made was that of the case of Trevor Taff. Now, Trevor Taff was convicted in 2016 for the 2012 murder of the mother of his child. Her body was found on his property in a septic tank and obviously she had been killed in, in a pretty terrible way. The body showed stab wounds, she had been decap decapitated. 
And what the court said, what the judge asked is, hold on, here is a case involving distressing circumstances, a young woman, a mother of a child, and she was killed in pretty terrible circumstances. So what makes this cartel case so different and so special that it should leapfrog cases like Trevor Taff that are waiting for retrial? What the, the prosecutor said in response was that, well, they're not trying to compare victims of the case. What they are saying is that in this case, a cartel case, there ready for retrial they'll be as ready they'll be ready as early as the next court term which begins in september after the summer break and five looks like we're going to have a speedy judgment here the presiding judge marva mcdonald bishop said the court is going to be working assiduously to deliver a timely judgment they're aiming for a judgment by the end of this current court term which ends at the end of july so of course we'll be watching see you people leave on a thoughts on all of that in the comment section you see me but now we are going to move on and i don't know the whole thing we are growing with spice now since she dropped our song the what, 2085 t where a story for bugger things in the public spice went live to reveal some shocking details even me surprised somebody can you know say spice bash it boss and i tell it boss about him mad and all of them something there you see me anyhow somebody mistakenly messaged spice thinking that it's rt and spice basically exposed them number them picture every single thing and the message that was sent so I'm going to check out the part of the live there. I want you to leave your thoughts on it in the comment section. You see me? Remember to like the video. Remember to share the video. And remember to subscribe if you're new. Check it out. I said three years after you so long. Because remember, you know, remember I said no I'm going to go through the trial and tribulation. I don't understand it. So I'm going to keep my silent. I have to share it with you now. You see how long I don't answer those. Say nothing. I just hold my mouth. And today when I come and talk, everybody. I come out from underneath them nest and everything just start revealed to me and me I realize that one plus one equals two. Go in on my phone and show you something because I don't understand what I'm going on. I tell you that this is a war, a spiritual warfare. I don't know, believe me. I'm going to show you something. Hold on. I'm going to reach home. So hold on a little bit. Let me go for that screenshot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, how am I going to let you the money through the gate? Hold on, I can show you something. Hold on, the one second. Next phone. I just reach home. Soon, I'm going to go through the security gate. Yeah. I soon reach home. I have to get the next phone because today I have to show you something. Because I have to talk about Jesus. I have to talk about Jesus today. Okay, she said fit um spice official starts pin. Me like oh you said this. Me like oh you said this. I say one thing me like. Me like say my best to them bright. Me have some bestie when go to school. Me not have no dunce bestie. Look power my bestie type. My bestie say, why they not mad at each other? Why they not mad at each other? Everybody, all of them have something to say about me. Nobody has nothing to say about each other. Somebody sent me something a while ago. Said Lala right where Ipisi me never blood clot look pan him because I know him the right at Ipisi but all the fucking night going you're going at the girl room. I know you don't write nothing about it. Jesus, come here if you're not busy. Mighty God, me dead for come out of the carrier. Spice QOD so we're doing streaming after the Queen live. Wanna click on the link in our bio, Spice QOD. Make sure you follow my best of them. Follow Spice Official. That starts. Follow Spice QOD. Them your official people. Them your people you know what time it is. Me see me reach out of the car. You just hold on a little bit. Stop right here, so stop right here. So go on. Me never show them blood clad, please. It's okay. I don't must feel like say. Among can you use the other garage, please? Uh, the next one.
Thank you. Me reach home. Hold on. Me go for my next phone. Well, me think the screenshot did another phone, yeah? Me want to show you today me talk about Jesus. Me want talk about other people today. Today me want to show you something. Me say, God start reveal people to me. The woman text me by mistake. She delete some advice note them and then she realize they a mistake. But me make sure I save it all on a little bit. I shouldn't even say that before I go for your next phone because she would have gone delete it. But I done did screenshot it to daddy phone already. Thank you so much. You have a good night, okay? Yeah, you too. Is my other shoes? Oh no. Well on then I'm reach one. I go for my phone. Because I go show and say, and the devil me pray to him. He's not a devil worshipper. Me is not a devil worshipper, so hold well on there. I got me worship, so I'm going to show you something. What about my boss? Nice, clean sun, outside and bright. So I can never turn on the light. Jesus. Ah, my, my other phone. Pass it for me, they do. I got my shoes in my house. I come in with the piece of the shoes. What on there? Show you something, because I don't understand. We don't really understand why I'm going out the road. <coughs> I'm showing you something. Baby, something. Look for blood clot like this. Eh? <laughs> you like it? I order, we may have too much phone. Other password, I go. I order password for my next phone, Nicholas. Okay, hold on, sit ya. Hold on a little bit, sit ya. All right. So, man, delete the device, not the menu, but guess what? Hold on. So, for you who just come from the live, may I try to tell you, no, say, me worship a miracle working God. My God, when me worship him, name Jesus. You never understand? And, me have my phone, remember, you know, me a girl, me a ram for go down in a prayer and worship, you know. So when so I pray, and the world is confusion, I never to listen to the nice because I know that so I serve a God. Yo, I don't have a revelation right now where God just reveal everything to me and everybody and every people and all those just a tumble down and people are come out, come talk. People are, God confuse them. God make the enemy, them all are text my phone and think them are text the enemy. The girl thinks she text RT and when you look at me, she text and chat me. Try me, I try showing about my God when I worship, say my God no play about me, I don't no understand. Let me reach out my yard and get my next phone. Watch this. Flip that camera and show on something. Hold on. This a girl, this is her number. Make sure you can see it. Clean up the camera screen. See her here. She. She has text me from Sunday. Look, see her number there? Her name come up as Swan. Look now, what the girl say? Look what the girl say. Cause I don't feel like say my Jesus as some look as some look dibby dibby idiot boy. As how I don't feel like say. I don't can't play with God. What the girl say? Hello, me I give you some tea and spice. So I realize now say the girl text me by a mistake. I don't make sure I get her number now. We are England today now. This is Sydney, this a, this a number you come from. We are England, you know, girl named Swan, you know. I text her back and I say, give it to me. Here are. Here are. Never take papi her life. She start delete her something. Here are. Watch her text my phone. Dirty spice say, she a get to you next. <laughs> She don't know me now. Oh, she get me number. God all a blood clot confuse them. It come like that. It come like the girl. Ask somebody for the man, the enemy number. God make she get my. <laughs> Yo, no father take me crazy. You don't never see it. You don't never understand when me I try to tell you no. 
The girl asks me the enemy number. Oh God, make she get my number. And the girl texts me and I chat me. <laughs> I don't want to tell me, but oh my God. Oh my God, I don't want to talk about Hold on a little bit. Oh my God. They can attack me. Somebody not them. She delete some advice not them and I talk about. Me have to be careful because I'm a job. See the girl attack me. You blood clad swan. See her yeah. See her number there. Mm -hmm. Swan. Let me make sure I flip the camera and show her. I want to get the number right. Swan, I don't know you, but today somebody gonna send you this video. When them send you this video, my name is Grace Hamilton. And you see my name? You don't play about me, I'm chosen by God. You see what you hear me nearly dead and people are laugh, they never understand when I got you. Me is a two life me have, because God not ready for me yet. You know what it means to be chosen by God? If you don't know, look it up. I am chosen by God. My spirit is not a normal spirit. That's why the enemy wants it. Because we have a strong spirit. So Suan, welcome to me, Grace Hamilton. Them call me Gracie. I don't know who give you my number. But God make you text me because I need to get a message. Say I saw the whole on a plot up and a scheme up to come up against me. Because when you see black woman succeed and it's a bono no. And I don't like it. A ghetto galia. A ghetto galia where Uno say never go reach no way. Uno never understand, say. When we go down for my knee, and I say, God, I start to use back God word for him. God can't play with me now because I know my Bible. Now. When I say, God, member, say you say. God, member, say you promise me, say. Hey, hey, yeah. Uno know, Uno know. All who are plot up against me, if you know what I know about Jesus Christ from Nazareth, you know would have leave me alone. But because you don't know about my God, because you don't know when I walk up and down in this house and chant out, you know would have leave me alone. But you don't know, so I just pray and say, God, forgive them because they know not what they have done. So you welcome to me, Suan, whatever your name from England. God don't play about me. I me you did a talk to. You chat me with me. You never know. You never did know. It's me you are chat with me. And you never did know.